I really like this painting, The Blacksmith Shop. Um, it's got so many things in it that, that keep me interested and amused. So you've got 10 people in the picture and a horse. Um, you, they're all around this central section of, of white hot metal. And they're all playing a part in the story, but we don't really know what the story is. I find it interesting that Wright often paints stories that, that cause us to have a conversation or to ponder about what he's actually writing about, what it is that that story is that he's telling. So in this picture, you've got the, the three blacksmiths working, one of them working the bellows and, um, and, and then them beating the, 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 the bit of iron. What they're making, we're not sure. You've also got another blacksmith, the older blacksmith, who sat there with the children around him, holding his hammer. What's he doing? What's he thinking? He looks deep in thought. And then you've got the people outside, the, the woman on her horse, um, talking to the, to the men who are stood by the horse, and possibly somebody else who's just outside the scene that you can't quite see. Is she traveling somewhere? Is she on a journey? Is she um, on a horse which has gone lame and needs a new horseshoe? And um, she's got the blacksmiths up at, uh, up at night to, to make her a, a horseshoe and fit it. Um, we don't know. And we'll never know. And that's the beauty of a painting like this, is it gives us questions to ask. And it allows us to tell the story. So as we look at it, we can decide for ourselves what's going on. Why are the children up in the middle of the night? How close they are to that burning brand of iron. Um, are the sparks from it as it's hit burning their backs um, or, or setting their clothes alight that we just can't see out of the picture? The bright bar of iron in the center of the picture almost takes the form of baby Jesus in the stable. It's, uh, it's almost as if industry is the new religion in the 18th century, replacing the old world with a new bright uh, future. And, and then there's the church. They're in a ruined church. Why would they be in such a building? Where would Joseph Wright get the idea for such a thing? Well, we do know that the church in, in, in Little Eaton was ruined and for a time was rented to the local blacksmith. But a blacksmith shop with holes in the roof, that can't be very efficient um, or, or very easy to work in. The moon lighting the scene. There are no other lamps, just the light of the bar and the moon. Is that enough light to work by? How dangerous could that be? What would health and safety say to us today if we were working in, in that environment? So this painting, with its many hidden stories, the people and their thoughts and their conversations that they might be having, we can only ponder what they are. And that, for me, is what this painting is all about.